parts of the south are turning into a winter wonderland. It looks pretty, but for an area not used to slick snow and ice, the sprinkling is creating a travel nightmare on roadways in Georgia and Alabama. Some portions of the area are reporting over five inches of snow. This is one of the largest southern snowfalls in many years, leaving many without power tonight. Well, back at home, we're also talking snow in the forecast. You are looking live over the Chicago River, which could see a dusting of snow tonight. Steve is here now with when and where we can expect the actual accumulation. You know, it's possible we may not get as much snow as Atlanta. Really? Or Birmingham, places in the deep south. Uh, we're going to start to get this accumulating snow overnight tonight. Snowing lightly now in many parts of the area. I think within the next hour or so, downtown will have snow flying. So we just have to wait. Illinois. Uh, much less of a snow uh, anticipation than what we have in Indiana over the next 24 hours. Some folks already have some snow that's stuck uh, out where Terry is. That's in DeKalb County, three tenths of an inch of rain uh, as of about 9:30 or so. It's, it's snowing now up on the North Shore. Checking in with Hank in Evanston. Very light snow that's falling there, and it feels like it's 25 outside. Let's move on. Continue to talk about the rest of this weather story. Look closely, and you'll see where that band of snow is from the city north. That's where that. Uh, whitest shade is. You can see it there all across our northwestern parts of Cook County and out through DePage. Southside hasn't had any snow yet, although they've got your share of clouds there. Schiller Park, some light snow in the air. Schaumburg has had snow falling around that area. Oak Park and Cicero, if it's not snowing there now, uh, you can count on it happening within the next half hour. Other side of the lake, though, that's where the major concerns are. Porter County and LaPorte County, they both have uh, alerts in effect. One for a winter storm warning, that's in LaPorte. A winter weather advisory until 6 o'clock in the evening for places like Valparaiso, Westchester, and Chesterton. Slightly less amounts of snow expected there than other places, but it could be a nightmare trying to drive south and east outside of the city. One to two for most of us. That's in Northeast Illinois. Then you get around here to Porter County and it becomes a different story. That's where you get that four to six inches of snow possible. Look at what could happen around Berrien County in Michigan. Anywhere from six inches of snow to nine inches of snow by Saturday night. So around the lake and south and east of Chicago, especially is where we're really concerned about tomorrow afternoon. 31 degrees at O'Hare, 33 at Midway. Uh, the wind chill factor is not great because of that cloud cover that's developed, so it still feels like it's in the 20s. It will actually be in the 20s overnight tonight along with that snow. We'll call for 24 degrees. So a couple inches of snow possible to have to shovel away tomorrow morning in Chicago. Watch for your driving through northwest Indiana in the afternoon. Sunday looks good. Uh, dry. Monday could be some more light snow up to an inch or two and then Wednesday and Friday next week. Erica, uh, all of these numbers are below normal for this time of year and look at all those chances for snow and all those chances to have to shovel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Steve. Well,